Yo, what is up ladies and gentlemen, it's your boy Mumbleet. Welcome back to another video. And today we're gonna show you dudes how to grind the team of the season upgrade. So if you do enjoy, smack the like button, subscribe if you're new. Um, let's see if we can get 50 likes and comment down below. What is your best pull out of the team of season upgrade if you do do it? So it is repeatable five times and it refreshes in 23 hours. Let's take a look at the requirements and the ways I'd recommend doing this. So you need a team of the week player or a team of the season player. You need an 84 rated squad and you need 55 chems. So it's not gonna be too hard to complete, especially if you're getting a lot of fodder elsewhere or you have stuff laying around, you can get a couple of these done pretty simply. Now, where would I recommend you get this? We got a couple player picks out at the moment. We have an 82 plus player pick. If you wanna put stuff in here, um, you need six rare golds for this one, 30 chem. Um, all golds needed in general. Um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna run through these first and then we'll go over how to do it just so you kind of know the format of this video. We got league specific 25K packs. So we got one for the Prem, we got one for La Liga, Bundesliga, League One, um, Serie A. And essentially what these are gonna need is 11 rare golds. You're gonna need 45 chem for here. And this is gonna give you three rare gold players from the league and nine commons. So it could be a pretty good way to get some commons and potentially pack a team of season there. But this is the one I am eyeing up the most. It's the 80 plus EFIGS player pick. It's a one of four instead of a one of three like you get in the 82 plus player pick. Um, and it's only from the top leagues. That's what that means. Um, so if we go in here, I'm gonna show you, player quality is exactly gold. You only need two rares and 30 chem. So this is gonna be pretty cheap to do, especially when rare golds go up. You're probably gonna see common golds start to go up too. I just used a bunch of off league cards that don't have league SBCs, just to kind of show you what the odds are of potentially getting something in this first pack. Um, and then we'll show you how you can pick these cards up to get these SBCs done. And I got a tropical ball. I don't know why that's there. All right, anything good? 84 in the first one, sweet, I will take that. Um, I don't know if that's a duplicate or not, untradeable or tradable? Okay, it is tradable, so I can move it up. So, like I was saying, rare golds are probably gonna get expensive. So if you wanted to right now, you could go to the market and look at what the buy now is, if you have nothing in your club. So for example, if I go to 700 coins, everything should be selling within the hour. Yeah, it looks like 37 minutes left things are selling. If we go to 750, you're gonna see this is gonna slowly start going up in price. Already cards are getting bought out. So what you can do if you wanted is you can bid less than the buy now. So if you want to bid 650, 700, mass bid on as many cards as you can win, store the ones in the club that you're gonna use in the SBC that you need rares for, and then sell the rest of the cards on for a little bit of profit to then pay for the common golds if you wanna pick them up. Um, what are common golds at currently? I think they should all be 400 coins. Yeah, they're all 400 coins. With the, um, the F... EFIGS player pick that might shoot common golds up a bit. So if you're struggling to win common golds or they seem super expensive, you got a couple other options on how you can get these done. The two places I would go personally for me, I would go to the foundation section. If you have any silver untradeables or just random silvers laying around your club, you do the silver upgrade. All you need to do is put in 11 silver cards that can be rare or common. Doesn't matter. As long as you get 30 chem, you submit this. This is going to give you three common gold players so for the 80 plus top leagues player pick what you could do is you could do three of these which would be 33 silvers gets you nine common golds potentially could pack something along the way there if a team of the season is a base common gold or if an in or i guess you can't get informs anymore right um if a libertadores card is a i don't even think the libertadores cards are Never mind, scratch that. Um, you can open these and this will get you League SBC cards, could get you off league cards, whatever the case may be, these common golds can be put into that player pick. So I'd do that. Um, if you run out of silvers and you wanna pick them up or you see common golds get super expensive, another way I've seen people do this is if you go to your transfer market, you go to silvers, you go to 200 by now, you're gonna notice that not everything is selling within the hour. But let's say we go to a league like the third division of England. Um, it looks like everything's selling within the hour. Things that are English sell for a little more. So if you wanted to, you could mass bid on this league, 150 on the cards, 150 times 11 is gonna be the cost of making a three player gold pack. And then anything else that you pick up that you don't wanna use, you could sell on for a minimum of 200 coins. And if it's English, it's probably gonna go for a little more, 250, maybe 300. So not only are you making some common gold packs, you are also getting some um, 
profit as well if you wanted to. Also, what you could do is if you wanted to take a step further than that, if you take those common golds and let's say you don't wanna buy rare golds, you could then go to foundations again, go to, um, it says silver upgrade, you could go to gold upgrade where you put 11 common golds into here, and you get yourself two rare gold players. Another place you can look for rare golds if you're low on them is the League SBC teams if you go or not league sbc i'm sorry guys um if you go to the icon teams the first two teams you need a full rare bronze team this will get you a two rare gold players pack um and you need a full rare silver team with 50 chem this will get you a two rare gold players pack both of these tradable by the way so you could go through if you haven't done this before every single icon that's available right now do both of these you'll get then four rare golds total in each one of these icons and that will add up pretty quickly and who knows you might pack something crazy out of it uh, but yeah, that would essentially be my grind this week. The way I'm personally going to do it myself, if you want to know, um, since I'm trying to pack the Libertadores, um, to Libertadores special cards, I can't do the league specific or the top five league upgrade pack. Where is it? It's in the team of season, right? Yeah. Those would be excluded from this because it's only the top leagues. So I am probably for the most part going to do two things. I'm going to do the Premier League upgrade for the Prem. That way, I can put all my rare golds from, let's say, other leagues into here or um, rare golds that I'm just not using in general. I can put them into here. And then from here, I can get a bunch of untradable fodder for the Prem League SBC, which can get me a 50k pack. Um, so I might do that where I'm just grinding through the Prem, making a bunch of 50k packs and hoping to pack the Libertadores players from here. Um, if your goal is, again, to back, like, say, a Premier League player or a Serie A player, your best bet would probably to do those league-specific 25k backs. So if you're trying to get a Prem team of the season that's an ultimate, I'd do this. If you're trying to get a Bundesliga um, team of the season that's an ultimate, I'd do this. And you can kind of test them out and see which ones work best. It's really going to be your own pack look at the end of the day. Any of these options are going to be good to grind. And again, for the team of the season upgrade, the whole goal of this video was essentially to show you how to grind this. Anything you do is going to give you fodder for this. So in reality, this you're just doing for fun. This you're doing for a chance at something. All the other stuff is kind of more specifically catered towards what you want to do. So you might be watching this video right now and you might be more catered towards the prem. Sweet. Go there. Someone might watch this video and want to do 82 plus player picks more. Sweet. Go there. You notice I didn't cover the 82 to 88s because these are typically pretty crap. Um, yeah, <laughs> don't do this. Two rare players needed. Um, the rest common golds and you get an 82 to 88. That's really going to be nothing. Um, but yeah, if you have any questions, feel free to let me know. Uh, yeah, good luck, dudes. Let me know what you get. I'll catch you next time. It's been your boy Mumbley. I'm out. God bless.